How's it going guys? Welcome to my channel Project Play here. Today I'm going to show you how to quickly clear up some stuttering issues that you get on your PC, especially on those demanding games that you play. So first things first, you want to go to this website, I'll link it in the description. And the tool that we're going to be using is called NVIDIA Inspector. So just go down here and where is the download? Okay, I think it's on. Yep, so you want to click on one of these mirrors. I, it just doesn't matter, so just quickly download it. And I've already had it downloaded here. So I'm, what I'm going to do is copy it over to my desktop here and then extract it. Yeah, common sense. So we go up in here and then that's what it is. You can just copy this to anywhere on your PC pretty much. Uh, just go run as admin. I don't think you need to, but just do it in case it needs to override some files or something. So you go into your driver settings here. Um, I don't know why, just that button over there. So what you want to do is, uh, first of all, you want to find the game that you want to sort of clear up this for. So maybe you have uh, Metal Gear Solid, yeah? So you go Metal Gear. It's a pretty new game, so basically the games on this get updated as the drivers come out for, for the games by NVIDIA. So what you do with this program is you you set the game profile to the actual game instead of letting it sort of randomly decide this sort of clears up clears um, any areas up sort of ish okay here we go so what you want to do is click this add application to current profile and then you want to navigate to the directory of your game so mine's in steam so where is that that's not it there we go steam and then Steam apps. This is where. So you, you, if you if you have your games on Steam, just follow this directory. Common and there we go. And then that's your executable. You want to find the executable. Sometimes it's in like say for Counter Strike. Okay, it's in that. But um, sometimes you have to kind of dig in the files. Like usually it's in a bin file. To so yeah, just go into that. Yeah. So let's just do this for the for now. So you, you select the profile and it says here what you've selected. What you want to do is go apply changes. And yeah, it doesn't give you any confirmation messages or whatever. Just click apply changes and then just exit out of the program. Um, you can also use this tool to show you stats of your hard, um, hardware, your graphics card. I have a 780 here. Um, so you can change your fan speed and um, just overclock your... Um, a graphics card if you really want to but I'd, I'd recommend you use MSI Afterburner or something like that for that alright so now you've done that you want to run the game see if it's anything's still um, if it's still stuttering or yeah so we're just gonna quickly run this game see if it's better Get the targets to the RV. Alright, so we're back here. Just test out the game. Alright, so, I mean, um, I had some uh, small stuttering issues with this before. Uh, I've done this before, so I know it works for me. So, I mean, it's, it's worth trying giving it a shot. Yeah, so. Um, this mission is so kids just keep running but um, all you have to do is get them to the other side but I'm going on topic here so basically the issues are kind of fixed I mean they are fixed um, okay. oh, all right guys so basically I mean you can't I can't really show you a proper comparison I mean it um, when you record with shadow play it doesn't really record any stuttering it just records the direct output from your GPU I believe so I mean just give this a shot it will work most of the time I mean I have there are there are those instances where it doesn't work it's happened to me um, it didn't work for me when I was um, I think it was uh, Skyrim yeah Skyrim I think that was there's something wrong with that engine or game engine or something I think it had to be patched because this is a uh, this is fairly good tool to kind of fix up your errors that you get I mean this definitely worked for me on Metro Last Light and Battlefield 4 yep definitely um, yeah, just give this a shot. It's free. You have nothing to lose. Thank you for watching. See you on the next episode.